station was built by the Taft Vale Railway and opened on the 9th of October 1840. It was known as Newbridge Junction until March 1866 when it was renamed Pontypreed. It was progressively remodelled during the 19th century but its present appearance derives largely from the reconstruction carried out between 1907 and 1914, reflecting both the narrow, steep-sided topography of the valley and the need to accommodate many converging passenger routes and passing coal trains. It is effectively designed as two back-to-back -back termini. This gives it the most longest island platform in the world, around which are arranged seven platforms. The west side of the island platform had two stepped platform faces, originally platforms one and two, each originally capable of accommodating a full-length train. The east side of the island platform had three stepped platform faces, originally platforms five, six and seven, arranged as a north bay platform, a through platform and a south bay platform. The north platform of the island platform accommodated two bay platforms, originally platforms three and four, which are now filled in. The North End Bay platforms were used for services to Aberdeer, Nelson and Isipul. God, there's a letters that shouldn't be together. And the South Bay platform was originally for services from Clantrasant and Cowbridge. The modernisation of 2014 and 2015 brought former platform through platform platform 6 back into use as a bay platform, now numbered platform 1 for southbound services to Cardiff. Due to the loss of the railway land and the road widening, the southern end of the concourse of the new bay platform had been cut back and reprofiled, and its track was now slewed partly in the adjacent track bed of the former bay platform 7. Architecturally, in 19, the 1912 station still includes the original red brick and terracotta buildings on the island platform, some of which remain in public use, i.e. As the ticket office and the waiting room. The elaborate 1912 main station facade, it, the same Art Nouveau style, was destroyed during modernisation in the mid-1970s and replaced by a featureless red brick wall. The station subsequently achieved listed building status in 1990 for its architectural interest as a fine Edwardian railway station, retaining the original character. The 1970s facade was itself replaced by a mainly blue brick wall in the 1990s, temporarily exposing the severe damaged Edwardian facade. So let's get started here at Pontypridd with 152282. Departing with the 0842 Transport for Wales service and Barry Island to Aberdeer. Next train out to depart is 15267, working the 0854 transport for Wales service from Aberdeer to Barry Island. Coming around the corner through the rain is 15256. Working the 0858 Transport for Wales service from Barry Island to Merva Tidville. Next four departure is 15281. Working the 0908 Transport for Wales service and Merva Titville to Bridge End.
Flying around the corner through the rain is 150-252. Working the 0912 transport for Wales service and bridge end to Aberdeer. Next up for departure is 150.257, working the 0924 transport for Wales service from Aberdare to Barry Island. Next northbound service is 15255, work at the 0928 transport for Wales service from Barry Island to Merva Tithville. And your final train of the session is 15245, working the 0938 Transport for Wales service of Merva Titville to Barry Island. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed what you saw, click on the two videos here at the end screen. It helps out the channel. Also, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you uh, are new and got this far. And we'll see you all in the next video, folks, wherever that may take us. We'll see you then, folks.